Howdy folks, TJ here. Today is the game of the week again at Sinclair Society and uh, last week Louis Lima had chose the game, Gyroscope, really hard. Uh, this week uh, Stu Beer has been the chosen one to select the new game of the week and he has chosen Fred. I've actually played Fred before and I did a video on it last year sometime, just me kind of winging it trying to play it. So um, I, I kind of remember it a little bit, but uh, my mind can be a little foggy at times. So uh, it's going to be kind of probably all mostly fresh and new again. Plus, I've kind of got allergy issues again today. I actually um, was hoping to dive into my next today, but I've got not just seasonal allergies. I've got year-long allergies that really kick my ass. And um, so I've taken the normal allergy medications and stuff, and it kind of makes me a little bit more dopey than normal. And so I didn't want to dive into the next and do any type of upgrades or anything like that when I'm not in a 100% state of mind. But playing video games, that's perfectly acceptable. So I thought I would play Fred uh, a little hopped up here and uh, see how I play. I brought up the uh, instructions over here on the screen. I'll read them off to you. Then we'll go ahead and turn the sound on. I've already got the game loaded up. We'll give it a play. I do want to know, though, Stu Beer, if that's your real name. Uh, I can see Stu standing for Stu uh, or Stuart. Uh, but Beer, I don't think I've ever seen anybody with the last name of Beer. So is that really your last name? <laughs> Inquiring minds want to know. Uh, anyway, let me read the instructions here. So... Uh, at the very beginning of the instructions, it says, Action beneath the pyramids. Fearless Fred, the intrepid archaeologist, searches the creepy catacombs below the torpid, T-O-R-P-I-D, torpid tomb of Tuti Carmoon. That's how I'm reading it. And uh, I think this game was made in Spain, or at least the folks that have it uh, have a Spanish language, because there's a number of copies that you can play, and all of them seem to lead back to a Spanish type of uh, writing. Uh, so I'm guessing at that. I didn't really research it, sorry. Um, I'm going to uh, use the keyboard. I'm not going to use a mouse. I don't have a, a mouse adapter for the uh, uh, toast rack as of yet, so... Let's go down here and read a little bit more about the game. So, monster, or the game. The more tombs, mazes, Fred explores, the tougher the going. The number of monsters increases, and they get meaner, meaner and faster. I feel like I'm about to sneeze. So, yeah, I'm hopped up. Uh, perfect time to play video game and do a video. <laughs> um, rats. These run through the labyrinth. The only way to avoid them is to jump at the right moment. Acid drops from the decomposing mixtures of Egyptian magicians. Careful timing is needed to get past them. Ghosts, beware. They can go through walls. They change direction when shot. So I guess I've got a gun, and I don't think I remember that the last time. I don't think I shot anything. Probably why I didn't do as good and probably won't do good again. I, well, I remember to shoot. Uh, chameleons, they can be passed by climbing the rope on the opposite side, but they can change sides too. That's confusing. Mummies, they fall through the vertical corridors. They can teleport when they stop falling or are hit by a bullet. Vampires, holy crap, this, this thing's got vampires too. They chase through the maze and can stop flying or even develop a high speed. They can be stopped by being shot. Skeletons, they chase relentlessly and can only be stopped by being shot. Power, Fred's strength is maximum at 15 and reduces by one each time a monster hits. Two extra units are gained each time the magic elixir of the Nefertiti is drunk and when he reaches the exit. Weapons, Fred has a gun and six bullets, which he can replenish in route. He cannot shoot whilst climbing a rope. Okay. Treasures, varying in value. They may be picked up by just walking over them with bonus points on exit. Map, a map is displayed when Fred discovers one in the maze. Fred is the center. Fred is in the center. Screens, there are six screens, increasing difficulty, followed by the option to return to screen one or redefine the maze. The number of monsters has to be 
they find with figures, blah, blah, blah. Okay, that was it. So that was the text. Let me turn off this screen. I'm going to turn off that camera over there and zoom in so we can watch me play terribly. Da -da 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 -da. That is like the world famous tune for everybody's first video game and second video game and third video game. <laughs> I, I've not used it yet though, but I've only made one game. Okay, just me positioning the camera. Okay, define keys. So yeah, I'm going to define them because this originally wanted you to use Q, W, E, and R. That was very confusing for me. I need to have it different. So, um, do I just hit return? I've got to wait for that screen. Okay, three, press key for up, Q, down is A, left is O, right is B, fire is space bar. All right, four. So I remember the graph. Ooh, what's that little guy? I don't think I remember seeing him. How do I get off here? Oh, I just wasted a bullet. Oh, is that a bullet? Oh, good. I don't know what it was. It's something. So you got to kind of jump up on the rope and then go up. Um, I don't see anything in here. Go back down. Oh, I shot a bullet! No, I don't want to keep hitting space bar and wasting bullets, dumbass! Up is jump. What a dummy. Oh, jump! I don't think you can shoot ghosts. I should probably look and make sure I get points for whatever I just touched. So you're kind of just exploring, running around. Graphics are really cool. Go get that talisman thing. Interesting game so far. I'm alive still. <laughs> uh, but I'm probably losing power and I'm not like really paying attention to important things. And I'm probably going down the same way I just came up. Um, I get lost in these type of games. I'm not good at remembering where shit is. Oh, job! Porcupines? I'm losing all sorts of points though. But I think I'm going to someplace new. So there is a point system, so I guess technically P 
people in our group can kind of say, yeah, I got 3,000 points or whatever. Oh, little porcupines. Oh, oh, jump. Oh, he's getting all red. Oh, hell, there's a lot. Oh, the ghost is attaching me up the, the ladders. Can I shoot ghosts? I don't have any more bullets. <laughs> oh. <laughs> uh, I got 3,500 points. Did I beat anybody? I don't know. But um, I don't know if I'm ever going to get past the level here. But I did run around for a while. Hey, I get to net enter my initials. T... No, I guess not. Congratulations, you have one of today's greatest enter. Your initials with one and two. Okay. Oh. Well, what do you hit? Enter. I'm hitting enter. Okay, there we go. I got to get my initials up there. T J. Uh, I don't want to do anything. TJZ. Okay, so let's play one more time. See if at least I can get... So I'm going to go immediately left this time. So don't waste bullets. Well, at least he turned the other way. Okay, so that was a good maneuver. Well done. Now, these little porcupines, I guess I need to jump over. Oh, I jumped! It's hard to, uh... Jump! He doesn't really, like, jump forward. He just goes straight up. He doesn't jump over those too well. I don't have the jumping thing right. Yeah, you just go straight up. Oh! I'm not coming up a lot A treasure here. Where's all the treasure stuff? Go up stuff. I'm losing massive amount of points. Don't go up. Don't go up. Go down. Damn little porcupine. Oh. I'm pushing left, why don't you? He doesn't like going left. There you go. <laughs> oh, damn, I'm jumping. Oh, man. I'm going to get less points on this one. Man, there's not a lot of treasure in this stuff here. I'm not getting good points on this one. So I could see uh, this game probably fun if you have uh, time to um, do an adventure. But it's not really like an arcade game where you can just kind of go for it. 
Oh, there's a talisman thing. Oh, is that a map? Jump! Shoot! Jump! Shoot or something! Oh. At least I got a new treasure this time. A, a map thing. You can see the map kind of drew in over there. So when you collect it, you can... Oh, I wanted to see where the frick I was. I'm not going to enter it in my initials. Uh, so you kind of get the gist of the game. That was the goal of the video. So I'll keep playing and see if I can get past level one. Uh, I'm all hopped up, so maybe I won't. Uh, but anyway, thanks for watching. Happy Friday, and see you later. Bye.